this is Bob Mason from FX Empire and welcome to the daily crypto tech review. We're looking at Bitcoin, Ethereum, Litecoin and Ripple's XRP. Looking at the MACDs, the moving averages and the day's support resistance and pivot levels. It is Wednesday the 2nd of December. Jumping straight into Bitcoin against the US dollar, we're looking at the hourly candlesticks. Better start to the morning after yesterday's pullback. Going to see Bitcoin move through the pivot at 19.016 to take a res- run at the first major resistance level sitting at 19.754. We see support from the broader market for Bitcoin to break out from 19,500 levels. So barring extended rally on, they expect that first major resistance level to cap any upside. In the event of breakout, could see Bitcoin break through 20,000 levels to test resistance at 20,500 before any pullback. Second major resistance level since at 26,93. Fed has moved through the pivot. We'll bring the first major support level sitting at 18,077 into play. Buying an extended sell-off on the day should see Bitcoin continue to steer clear of sub-18,000 levels. Second major support level sits at 17,339. Looking at the MACD, we've got a widening of the bearish histogram supporting this early pullback. And we're seeing the 50 narrow on the 100 and the 200, suggesting a further downside ahead. So failure to move through that pivot at 19,016 would bring support levels into play. Moving across to Ethereum against the US dollar. Positive start to the morning after an early pullback. Going to need to see Ethereum move through the pivot at 595.2, however, to take a run at the first major resistance level, sitting at 627.3. Going to need to see support from the broader market for Ethereum to break back through to 620s. So, barring an extended rally on, they expect that first major resistance level to cap any upside. In the event of a breakout, could see Ethereum test resistance at 650 before any pullback. Second major resistance level sits at 668.7. Failure to move through the pivot will bring the first major support level at 553.9 into play. Barring an extended sell off on the day, Ethereum should stay clear of sub 550s. Second major support level sits at 521.8. Looking at the MACDs, slight narrowing of the bearish histogram, but nothing suggestive of upside through the morning on the emas also a narrowing of the 50 on the 100 and the 200 suggests a further downside ahead so failure to move through that pivot level of 595.2 would bring support levels into play moving across to litecoin against the us dollar also found support early in the morning after its pullback at the start of the day then you see litecoin move through the pivot at 86 to bring the first major resistance level at 92.17 into play Support from the broader market is going to be needed for Litecoin to break back through to 90s. So barring an extended rally on the day, but that first major resistance level and yesterday's high at 93 to cap any upside. In the event of breakout, got the second major resistance level at 99.16 and the 62% fib at 100 to cap any upside on the day. Failure to move through the pivot would bring the first major support level sitting at 79.01 into play. Barring an extended sell off on the day, Litecoin should steer well clear of the second major support level sitting at 72.84. Looking at the MACD, we've got a widening of the bearish histogram suggestive of downside in the morning. And we're also seeing the 50 flatten on the 100 and the 200. So we need to keep an eye on that. So keep through the early part of the day would be to move back through the pivot at 86 to then target 90s and resistance levels. Failure to do that and support levels are in play. Finally, looking at Ripple's XRP against the US dollar, going to need to see Ripple's XRP move through the pivot at 0.622 and the 23.6% FIB at 0.6274 to take a run at the first major resistance level, sitting at 67.11. Going to need to see support from the broader market for Ripple's XRP to break out from 0.65 levels, however. So, buying an extended rally on the day, expect that first major resistance level to cap any upside. In the event of a breakout, you could see Ripple's XRP target resistance at 0.7 before any pullback. The second major resistance level sits at 0.7310. Failure to move through the pivot will bring the first major support up level sitting at 0.5621 into play. Barring an extended sell off on the day, Ripple's XRP should avoid sub 0.55s and the 38.2% FIB at 0.5285. The second major support level sits at 0.5130. Looking at the MACD, slight narrowing of the bearish histogram, but nothing indicative of a bullish day ahead. So you need to keep an eye on that. 
on the EMAs, we're also seeing the 50 narrow on the 100 and the 200, suggestive of further downside ahead. So Fed is to move through the pivot at 0.622 would bring support levels into play.